make a two win at Hansworth today. Um, we had a little bit of hard work of it, but three points all matters again. Yeah, it's just three points. When you come away from home, Jay, you just, you, you, this time of year, you just want to get points on the board. Uh, I don't think it was our best performance. I don't think it was the best game of football I've ever seen. Um, but we've come here, we've got a job done, and, and we go home with three points. Yeah, we got off to a bit of a sloppy start, didn't we? We were gifted them chance after chance, and in the end, it took them. What did you put that slow start down to? Mentality. The warm up was really poor. So the lads before the game, if we start like this, we're in trouble. Um, we looked like a team that was first game of pre-season in the warm-up you know, there was no intensity there was no you know, we were back foot uh, and we started on the back foot we were sloppy the passes weren't good enough we were playing you know poor passes into midfield and there was stupid turnovers in bad areas of the pitch and I just don't think we were good enough for the ball for the first sort of 15-20 minutes and the intensity that we want to play which wasn't there for the first sort of 30 minutes until we scored until maybe Ollie's penalty um, and then that was sort of a turning point and we turned the screw a little bit then and, and, and we looked for periods we looked at a, a decent side but you know again you know we, we just struggled to kill the game off we, we should have probably killed the game off yeah Oli soon made up for his penalty miss in that first half um, a lovely move right in half time great time to score but it was a, a brilliant goal it? great goal great individual goal you know he's he's absolutely turned three or four players inside out and it's a brilliant finish from a really tight angle um, it's not all he knows he's disappointed with the penalty miss he's disappointed he knows he can do better than that but you know in fairness to him, you know, he, 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 he kept going, you know, and he he got himself back, you know, he, he got himself on the scoreboard and from there he sort of came alive a little bit and, you know, he ended up scoring the winner for us, so, yeah, we let him away with the penalty miss today, but yeah, the, the first goal was unbelievable. Yeah, just on the penalty miss, as disappointing as it was, obviously we can't be too despondent, as he's been faults from the spot this season, I think he's only scored in that one, he had to score the rebound as well, so... Got off, it? <laughs> yeah, listen, it's, it's probably not his best penalty in the world. It's probably an easy high for the keeper, but if it's one of them, if the, you know, it's probably a really good save. You know, we have to watch it back. Um, but all he knows is he can do better than that. Um, you, know, we, you know, we move on. You know, it is where it is. It's a penalty. People miss penalties. Um, you know, the, the, we show great character to keep wanting the ball, keep demanding the ball, and and to keep winning his one v one duels. And I talked today, and his one v one duels, he was, he was unstoppable. Yeah, the chances kept coming in the second half and got a huge slack of luck, luck, luck for the winner, uh, as you mentioned, Ollie Nolan grabbing it. Um, but at that point, we were knocking the door then, but it, it was chance of chance of chance and Bullen defensively went in. Yeah, it was coming It was coming for about five minutes before that. You know, we were we controlled the game in their half. We, we got into really good areas. We got several entries into the final third. We, we got the ball in really good areas. The keepers made one or two good saves. But we were, we were really dominant for sort of the first 25 minutes in that second half and then when we scored uh, we made a couple of changes to sort of get minutes into people and we, we lost our intensity a little bit off the back of the changes but I thought the last sort of 15-20 minutes we, we changed shape just to sort of see it out and I thought we defended very very well um, they, they just chucked it on us with long balls, diagonal balls, long throws, free kicks, uh, they just kept putting it on us I thought we won pretty much 99% of them aerial duels and we landed on more second balls so I thought, um, I thought we showed um, a good professional side to us in that sort of last 15 minutes today. Were you a little bit frustrated that we didn't make it more of a cup this afternoon than it perhaps could have been? Because we didn't have a chance to create today. People look at the scoreline and see 2 1 tight game. And obviously, Hansworth did have chances and they threw it, threw it, threw it out towards the end. But the amount of clear cut chances that we've missed today, again, it should have been easy 4 5 6 easy. Yeah, this is our problem, Jay. We're just not killing, killing teams off, which always gives teams a chance. And they're always in the game at 2 1. Um, and the last sort of five, ten minutes, we end up defending deep and trying to see the game out. Whereas, you know, we should be comfortable at that point. We should have kicked the game off. We should be able to, you know, rest people with choosing night in, in mind. And like I say, we're, we're just not killing games off at the minute. But when when we do start sort of scoring them goals, we're going to be a, a really good side. But like I say, I think we're building now. We're, you know, we've got an eye on next year now. We, we're building on next year. We we know where we need to strengthen. Um, so I, I think if we can keep the nucleus of this group next year and strengthening in one or two areas you know we can uh, we can really go and push on next year because the penny's kind of dropping now with, with the lads in terms of how we want to play um, so I think you know with, with another pre-season under our belt you know with a couple of additions to the squad I think we can uh, I think we can we can have a really good go at it next year